Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to another video of the TI4 app. In today's video, we're going to show you how to enable notifications in the app and what they'll look like during the game. This is a great feature that enables you to play your games over longer durations and even spread them apart over multiple days. Rather than the six to 12 hour straight sitting most of you will be used to when playing the tabletop version of the game. So while there's always the option to play the game in real time, notifications give you the option to play even when all players aren't present at the virtual table. The app notifications will give you timely updates for important events throughout the game, such as when it becomes your turn or when you receive a trade request from another player. Notifications are available on both mobile and desktop, but for today's video, we're going to stick to showing it on mobile keeping in mind that the steps for enabling notifications on desktop will be nearly identical. So I have the app open here on my mobile device and I have a game going. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump into this three player game. And we could see we're in the setup phase. Now, if you haven't enabled the notifications before, you're going to see this pop up at the bottom of your screen, which is asking you if you want to enable notifications. So we'll go ahead and click the checkbox at the bottom left. And once we do that, we're going to get a browser pop up here, which is again asking us if we want to grant this site the permissions to send us notifications. So we'll click allow here. And that's really all you need to do to set up notifications in the app. This process will look very similar regardless of the browser you're using. So here I'm using Google Chrome, but the steps will look pretty similar whether you're using uh, Firefox or Edge. So now that we've enabled notifications, uh, we want to see it in action now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and close the app and I'm going to wait for it to become my turn to place a system. So I'm going to close the app here and we're just going to give it a second until it becomes my turn again. Okay, so we see that we've gotten a notification here in our status bar. And we see it's giving us some inf information saying that it's our turn to place a system tile on the board. So if we go ahead and click the notification, that's going to open the app and it's actually going to bring us straight to our game. And now we can continue playing by uh, placing a system tile here. Now, besides the app notifying you of when it's your turn, the other thing it will notify you of is when you receive trade requests. So again, I'm going to close the app here and I'm going to wait for somebody to send me a trade request. So we see we've received our second notification here. If we look at this one, it's giving us a little different information. This time it's saying that we've received a new trade request. Again, if we click this notification, it's going to bring us right to our game. And we could see in our uh, trade menu at the top over here that uh, we have a new trade request. So that about does it for this demo. This was a, a short demo showing uh, the power of, of notifications. And uh, you can see how this will let you um, step away from the app while you're playing games, but uh, still complete your turns in a, in a timely fashion and uh, keep the game flowing. So we're going to stop the video here. And thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon.